Hello and welcome to another edition of Trotsky Robust. Today is Halloween, October 31st, trick or treat. Um, the trick's on us as usual. I hate to talk about this subject, but I have to. We're talking about Russia, Russia, Russia. Why Russia? You know, it's, I, I don't really know. The only thing I can think of, the main one, is really the Democrats don't really have much, anything else to talk about. Right now is the time to for them to fundraise. And who are they fundraising from? It's not their base. Their base is not, the small donors have given up on the Democrats, and rightly so. It's the big ones, the corporations. And of course, Democrats don't want to talk about Medicare for all or uh, um raising the minimum wage. Their, their corporations don't want to hear that. So they want to talk about anything but. So that that's why we're having Russia. Russia, Russia, Russia. And um, it's uh, it's actually not um, necessarily bad for the donors. Uh, one of the leading um, uh, uh, congressman, uh, Adam Schiff, he loves to talk about Russia. He's the main guy. And why is he the main guy? Well, guess who his uh, biggest com campaign contributor was in 2016? Northrop Grumman, a defense contractor. What a surprise. What a surprise that the person who talks most about Russia is being funded by a defense contractor. That's his biggest uh, campaign, campaign contributor. No, is it in the interest of Northrop Grumman to restart the Cold War? Yes, you betcha, yeah. you betcha. Yeah. Of course it is. And um, look, they have, and it's not like it's a one-sided thing. Don't kid yourself about this. Putin is not exactly popular in Russia. This helps him too. He doesn't mind playing along. Why should he? You know, I mean, one, Russia doesn't spend that much on defense. They spend about a, less than a tenth on defense than we do. But no, no, they're going to spend $100,000 on our election, and that's going to influence our election. You know, the fact that Hillary spent a, one to two billion, don't worry about that. 100000 by the Russian, that's what did it. That's why she's not president. Look, this is all nonsense upon nonsense, all right? Um they, they don't have anything to talk about. Um, and here's the best part of it, though. Th this is how you know it's total BS. Total BS. You know, Tony Podesta. Tony Podesta. Part of the Podesta group, along with his brother, John Podesta. Who's John Podesta? That was Hillary's campaign manager. So, you know, the <laughs> oh, what a tangled web we weave when we practice to deceive. I am so glad one of their own got ensnared with this, which means that the story is not going to, I mean, it's not going to die. It's going to continue. It's probably going to continue until the election, um, unless hopefully Bernie's the nominee. If Bernie's the nominee, he'll talk about the issues. Uh, I hope Bernie's the nominee for the Green Party instead of the Democratic Party. I hope the Democrat party dies a quick, uh, not quick, S sooner the better. The sooner they and their Republican die off, the better off this country will be. These are two anti-American parties, okay? Someone tells you voting green is a wasted vote. Maybe, maybe it is. Voting Republican, voting Democrat is not a wasted vote. It's a vote against the United States of America, okay? Better to waste your vote than to vote against this country. And that's what you do every time you vote Republican or Democrat. Uh, um matters not. Uh, you know, we saw it last year. Both the primaries were rigged. The We know the Hillary's was rigged. I mean, there's a reason why Debbie Was Wasserman Schultz resigned. Uh, a few others resigned. Donna Brazil was um, kicked off. The, it was fired from ABC. So what happens? Because she cheated. So what happens to a cheater? Well, they get uh, promoted. Right now she's going to be on the rules committee of the Democratic Party. All right, the rules. Com the person who cheated is go going to be on the rules committee. How rich! Um, there's no really other reason for it. Uh, Trump, of course, will try to get his tax cuts through. Hopefully, this will be give him cover from their perspective. Um, I think if tax, if Trump does get the tax cuts through, that's the end of Trump. I mean, his base, a large part of his base, people who believe him. This is not what they signed up for. They don't want tax cuts for the rich. They don't want to. They want to repeal Obamacare and replace it with Medicare for all, you know, or call, whatever they want to call it, the, uh, you know, f capitalist whatever. But it's essentially the same thing. They want Medicare for all as we do. Um, 
so the Suresha thing is going to continue. It's nothing upon nothing. You know, don't pay attention. Don't don't even worry about it. It's it, it's just a huge distraction. Uh, the fact that Tony Podesta got uh, caught up in it is great news. It, you know, I'm sure other Democrats will get caught up in it. Uh, you know, what's the accusation that they went and to Russia to get to gather dirt on a campaign, on Hillary's campaign? Really? Like, Hillary's campaign doesn't gather dirt on other people? Really? Good movie to watch from the 90s is Primary Colors. It's about the Clinton, Bill Clinton's campaign. It's They don't use their names, of course, but it's a great movie to watch. And I doubt very much that, you know, the Clintons are beyond gathering dirt. The, the Clintons... Uh, you know, perfected this whole thing. Watch the movie. It's a very good movie. Uh, enjoy your Halloween. Uh, you know, I just bought some candy. I end up, you know, a few kids come, so I end up eating myself, and therefore I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm fat. I'm fat commie, as a few of you have called me. Uh, in any case, tell me what you think. Please send your comments or like or dislike. Better yet, please uh, sign up, uh, subscribe. It's free; doesn't cost you anything. Uh, we can talk about anything except the BS that you hear, you see on TV. It's our, it's for us to call, call it out, not to, you know, pile on on it. There is no Russia story. There is no Russia story. The real story is Medicare for all, increasing um, wages. By increasing the minimum wage, that's how you do it. Spending money on infra infrastructures, stopping the wars, stop reducing our military presence. Those are the real stories. Both the Republican and the Republican-like parties oppose that. That's why you never, ever hear it. All right? Thank you. Have a good, happy Halloween. Trick or treat.